Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to a video. So today we are playing some more Metro Exodus and so this is gonna be episode 12 in the series and so um, I couldn't remember <laughs> really what we did in the previous one but I think we just um, left the, the desert location and we're now back on the train and um, whatnot. But I do like this like display of the guns and stuff, that's so cool. Um ah, it, it does it actually has the same attachments. Oh it is actually my actual guns. Oh that's so cool. Um I think in a previous um episode we were like talking to Anna and stuff, but yeah. I think we can exit. What do you know? Everything is perfect, Artyom. Follow us. Oh, he's drunk. Oh, I've never actually been out here. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> Lol. That's so cool. Nice. Okay. clicks behind us we have been through a lot the mirror hmm. all right people i do understand i can't keep it a secret much longer after a careful study of the satellite maps we've obtained <laughs> and much deliberation we found a place we could call our new home <coughs> it is a river valley there's forest and a hydroelectric power plant. Yeah. This place is quite far from densely populated areas, which, as our journey has proven, is important. We're about two days away from it now. So, congratulations! Yeah! 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 yeah. yeah. Yet, uh, this is not our last <laughs> order of business for today. Stepan, Katya. Oh yeah, I forgot oh, they got friends. engaged or married. Stepan, Katya, repeat <laughs> after me. <laughs> I take you to be my spouse. I take you to be my spouse. And vow to hold you from this day forward. And vow to for hold you from, from this day forward. For, for better or for worse. For richer, <laughs> for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and, and in health. health. To love and to cherish to and until to cherish death was part. As the captain of this ship, I hereby pronounce you husband and wife. Live long and be happy. Oh, and Gorka! Gorka! <laughs> Yeah. Anna, what's happening? Be careful, people. Anna, please hold on. What's happening? What Anna, what's wrong with her? Actually, because she was. Yeah, has been like coughing a lot and stuff. I 
I really hope she doesn't die. I'm sorry I didn't say anything. What are you talking about, baby? In Yamantau, when they dragged me away, that ghoul doctor said my lungs were falling apart. The gas I breathed in that ammo dump said I How don't have long. How that monster? We've just been through a desert and all that sand, so that might be the reason. Katya, Artem, a few words. I'm all right, Artyom. Go. I'm fine now. Your face is all bloody. <laughs> oh my goodness. I really hope she doesn't die. I don't know about this. The old man is furious. So, son, care to tell me what Carnal, do we do please. now? Let us not panic and think constructively. So, Katya, what do you think? I think that trusting some degenerate's diagnosis wouldn't be wise. A move from humid metro into the desert with its dry heat and sandstorms is a stress for us. Yes, I do think she'd be hit really bad right off the start had it my been My thoughts gas. exactly. Thus, first I'll check her condition to the best of my knowledge. Also, we're approaching the valley with its forest air. That alone could heal her. I'm sorry to intervene, but did something happen? Ah, oh, Anna coughed out some blood. My god. Do you really think it's the same? Sounds more like TB to me. That's for sure. TB we can handle. We've got enough antibiotics, and air does help with that. But what if... What if the degenerate was right, Katya? What do we do? Is there a medicine? There was an air defense battery station in our village. Right on the brink of war, they received a new drug. It saved a lot of people after gas exposure and general poisoning. I'll check my mom's records and find its name. I think it was produced in Novosibirsk. Right, Novosibirsk. Yermak, your opinion. For Anna's sake, I'd go to the edges of the earth. As for Novosibirsk, it's about 2,000 clicks. Then it's decided. We head for the valley. If it is suitable, we settle there. If Anna's state worsens, I'll take a group of volunteers to find that drug. So Katya, please, find that name for I'll us. I'll find it. Don't worry. One more thing, Artem. I want no surprises in that valley. You are our most seasoned scout. So take the rail car, one volunteer, Go check everything out before we arrive. Let's go back for now. Tell okay. Settling there. If Anna's health. Dad, please. <clears throat> I repeat, Anna, in case you start getting worse, there's a drug Katya told us about, so we can go and find it for you if it is needed. Mm, that sounds like a great plan. I'd also like to say this. Guys, please don't worry. I've been feeling pretty bad as it is for running the party. Oh, come on. You didn't ruin anything. I just brought myself down to rock bottom over that bastard from Yomantel. Though it must just be the sand and desert climate. Of course that must be it. We were discussing exactly that just now. All right. A toast. To you guys. Just be happy together. To you! To you! Ah! toast! Stefan, will you play that song? About us. Easy as pie.
Полковник Васин приехал на фронт со своей молодой женой. Полковник Васин созвал свой полк и сказал им, пойдем домой. Мы ведем войну уже 70 лет, нас учили, что жизнь — это бой. Но по новым данным разведки мы воевали сами с собой. Я видел генерала, они пьют и едят нашу смерть. Их дети сходят с ума от того, что им нечего больше хотеть. А земля лежит в ржавчине, церкви смешались с золой. И если мы хотим, чтобы было куда вернуться, время вернуться домой. Этот поезд в огне, и нам не на что больше жать. Этот поезд в огне, и нам некуда больше бежать. Эта земля была нашей, пока мы не увязли в борьбе. Она умрет, если будет ничьей, пора вернуть эту землю к себе. А кругом горят факелы, это сбор всех погибших частей. И люди, стрелявшие в наших отцов, строят планы на наших детей. Нас рожали под звуки марши, нас пугали тюрьмой. Но хватит ползать на брюхи, мы уже возвратились домой. Этот поезд в огне, и нам не на что больше жать. Этот поезд в огне, и нам некуда больше бежать. Эта земля была нашей, пока мы не увязли в борьбе. Она умрет, если будет ничей, пора вернуть эту землю себе. Этот поезд в огне, и нам не на что больше жать. Этот поезд в огне, и нам некуда больше бежать. Эта земля была нашей, пока мы не увязли в борьбе. Она умрет, если будет ничьей, пора вернуть эту землю себе. Есть действительно о нас, есть даже кернел в ней. Да, это время, мы взяли эту землю вернуть. И одна вещь. We don't want surprises like the ones we had on the Volga or in Yamantau. So we're sending a scouting party ahead on a rail car. Artyom needs a volunteer to support him. Me! Pick me! I'll check the hell out of that village! Please! <laughs> <laughs> Something makes me think that Alyosha is mainly going to check if there are any Amazons or women in general there. <laughs> <laughs> so we're all set. Oh, I can't choose who comes with me. You got a full family, a wife and child at once. And you don't have to worry about diapers or belly aches. Envy is a bad thing. We're not the ones to avoid diapers, Colonel. In fact, we're planning to present Nastya with a little brother, if she doesn't object. I'd rather get a sister. We could play with dolls together. I could care for her. You could play Sparta in special operations with your brother. Ah, cut it out, Stepan. God knows we've had enough of operations. I don't know about you, but I'm tired. I'd like to retire. Time to have some life. You can't retire yet. You're too young. <laughs> <laughs> I am old, Nastya. You're not. <sighs> You said envy was a bad thing, Nadia. Huh? But what am I to do? Your mom has you, but my Anna doesn't have a smart girl like you. Dad! <laughs> Don't dad me! A 20-year-old won't even think about children. But I would sure like to see grandchildren at my age. Yeah, you teach them CQC. Duels <laughs> pistols. <laughs> <laughs> Of course, you're welcome, Nastya. The thing is, Grandpa Miller won't give up until he has grandchildren of his own. Hear that, Artyom? I don't even know what else to say. She's beautiful, sporting. Yeah, I'm Olympic level with a rifle. 
I get not having kids in Metro. Darkness, TB, rats, mutations. But what about here? <laughs> right, Dad. We'll get to work on solving your problem tonight. How about a drink? To repopulation of Earth. To kids. Yes! To children! To children! Oh, I drank too fast. <laughs> No, we're all gonna get wasted. And having more women joining. I never doubted you. Yes, Alyosha. I don't think you should be worried about that. If we are successful, there will be people joining us. Honest, good people. I'm sure they survive too. Well, if any bad people decide to show up, they'll be sorry they did. <laughs> oh, definitely. When we're done with the bad apples here, we might think of something to do about Moscow. That's true. To love! To love! It's your turn, Artyom. Come on, impress us. Um. I don't know, how the hell do I toast? Okay, well, that was it. Um, I need to check. I think I need to come over... Uh, I think in the front. Uh, to actually go on. Sit with me, Artyom. Oh, you can actually do more, holy shit. This is so cool, I didn't know this was... You would be able to do, like, do all of this stuff in the game. I would just sit here like all the day. <laughs> um Step yeah. on, play some more. Step on. Could you give us that one? By Borisic. My pleasure. Okay, I guess uh, we need to get to it, so uh, let's move on. I can't say I've ever been religious, but right now I'm begging all gods, please. Watch over Anna, and make the valley cure her of her affliction. In the meantime, Alyosha and I are on a recon mission. We have no idea of what is waiting for us there. 
Though Alyosha seems convinced that there are going to be crowds of women eagerly anticipating his arrival. <laughs> if that turns out to be the case, then I have the best companion possible for this mission. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Uh, lol. Guess we just have to wait for it to finish loading. Yes, I must say, I'm rather partial to this valley. Take air for one. Makes your head swim. <clears throat> Never smelled air like this in my life. I bet if we spend a week there, it won't just cure Anna. It'll make Colonel grow his feet back. Yeah, so we're now like in a forage type Damn, place. This is one bumpy ride. The rails are all bent. The whole track seems to be fixing to slide down. I sure hope it can hold our weight. Let's hail the Aurora and tell them to take the other road. Come in, Aurora. This is forward recon. It does, does look a little bit sketchy. There's an actual dam. The general situation is completely awesome, Colonel. Sir, <laughs> is sure to love it here. Over. So the plan goes like this. We get to that dam, check it out quickly, and call them over. Just take a look at all this beauty, huh? Don't you want them to see it sooner? Oh shit, I totally look forgot to flip and actually craft some stuff on the on the workbench. Oh shit! Stop! Master! Oh my hell. Why did you drop your backpack? Oh fuck. Um, that just happened. Was the current really that, that cool fast? Who's this? Well, isn't that a scary ass mask? Oh, it's a woman. Hello. Caught your friend, but I can see you're two are not bandits. I'll help you out if you don't do anything stupid. Gotta run now. Just stay out of sight and you'll be fine. Catch you later. What? How long was I asleep? Holy shit. I don't like those sounds.
I guess I shouldn't go into the water. Do I still have my guns? I don't think so. Let me see. Nope. I have nothing. Well, shit. Hello? Well, I guess we're gonna shoot people with crossbows now. With no ammo. Oh, come on. Why the hell did they take away all of our shiny, nice guns? I don't like those wolves howling. I can hear cars driving or something. Do I still have my lighter? I do. Oh my god, get off me spider! I don't see anything else in here. I guess we go into the main building. Hello! What the fuck happened here? Did we get ammo? Oh, we did. Okay. I don't see anything else. Thankfully, we picked up some arrows. Okay, we got a crossbow. I'm scared that those wolves are gonna attack us. And I don't know where to go, so do I have my map? I do. Oh, really? We're li we were like halfway to the dam and then they... Oh my goodness. Still get to the dam. Who was that woman? I wish I knew her name so that I could talk uh, to her properly for saving me. Oh, okay. Well, shit! What the fuck? Who the hell shot that? Bandit. This territory belongs to the zone of the coast. Get lost or pay your life like others. Death to intruders. What the fuck? Oh, is that um? And I'll never forget this, I swear! Ah, these forest fuckers just left me here for the wolves! I don't seem to recognize you. Which barrack are you from? You sure have some nice gear. 
In any case, don't go there alone. I tried, and, well, you know what happened. Ah, these bitches hiding like fucking lizards. Ah, I found a way in and was going back already when the fuckers jumped me. Fuck. Ah, fuck. Both legs went to sleep. Can't even move now. Ah, I'll wait here till they wake up and go bring the boys. We have a good chance to get a drop on them forest fuckers now. We'll tear them apart like fucking rags. Just look, man. Tell me, which barrack are you from after all? I thought I knew everyone. Are you even from our camp? I'm not from here, bitch. Uh, well, if you're not one of ours, I'm in your debt anyways. I am Thank from... You, I am from the future. <laughs> These fuckers. If you want to get through their territory, you have to move like a ghost. Though, uh, you look so tough, you could take them all out by yourself, I bet. So I know, them right? Do them all in. They have it coming to them for hanging out boys from those posts. Okay, so... Watch out for scary ass people. Do I go this way, or...? Um, I see cool stuff up here. If I go this way, can I still get to the other side? So I don't have my backpack with me, so I wouldn't won't be able to like craft anything. I am sort of heading to the road again. Oh, I just skipped that whole part. Do I still have my mask? Oh, I do. Do I have my night vision? I don't. Okay. Hello? Do I have to go this way to... Um to actually get to where I need to go? Yeah, I think I need to go around here. Hello? I can hear people talking. Oh, an old school type mask. Okay, not much in here. Avast! Stop right there! It's the brethren of the coaster! Take another step and we run our rig on you! Aye! Another step and you die! <laughs> yeah, so beat it, you scallywag! If you know what's good for your ground-loving ass! Even one of you drifters we caught today is too much!
bitch. I'm not backing out. Got him. Yeah, I hit him once. But I, I really hope there's not a lot of them. Oh, I think these are the guys, um... That that other dude talked about. I'm not a bandit. Oh my fuck. Okay, let's not go in there. A lot of rats. It's been two months already. Nobody came for the kids. <laughs> Vicky and Tusha are coming back here. The dam workers told they'd give them the lift to the city, but I should have used my authority to stop them from trying. But back then, I still harbored hopes for evacuation too. Vain hopes. As I understand now, for what evacuation could we expect if there's only static on air? Help is not coming. Then again, do we even need help? Our valley was apparently not the target at all. Even the fallout seemed to have spared us. No, I didn't even see that guy. Um, oh, I probably need to put on my gas mask. Those guys are still looking for me. Hello. Any dead person down here? My night visions again or other night visions but yeah baby let's go Oh, so this actually replaces the the BB gun thingy, where it sh shoots the steel balls and stuff. There's so many routes I could actually go. Let's just check all of these bodies over here. Okay, there's nothing else here, I think, it seems. Let's put on the night vision. Turn it off. Because I'm going to try and take these guys out silently.
Okay, there's someone right there. I know you're here. We've been living in this forest for 20 years, so you can hide all you want. We have plenty of time. Me too. I was special forces. There's nothing here. How the fuck did you see me? Come find me, bitch. Oh fuck, I missed. Duh. Get out of here, guys. Don't run away, I wanna play. Fucking holy shit, look how many are there. Are they running away, really? Oh fuck, really? I really need to pick up my arrows. Oh my fuck. We got it all guys! We got all down here! There he is, an intruder! Let's see what's up here. I do about that. No. No. All right, guys, I'm back. Uh, sorry for uh, about that. My game actually crashed, um, and so I had to restart it and everything. So we're back where we left off. Um, I want to check. I need to get some more arrows. So, you guys remembered uh, before I, the vi I had to cut the video, we were like upstairs on top there, so remind me not to ring that bell thingy. So, I guess let's climb back up here. <clears throat> I only have two arrows, so... We're gonna have to try and do some thing to um pick up some arrows from one of these dudes. But I think before 
before we shoot them, I want to quickly check and see what's up here. Can it not hear me? Okie dokie. Let's stay alive then. Is there anything else down here? Okay. I need to somehow get down there. Oh, almost thought I found some arrows, but I guess it was not. Where the hell are they even? Let's check. You can't <laughs> forever, you dirty scumbag. None There's of one. Get out of our forest alive, and you know it. Is he like right in front of me, down below? Yep. Where's the rest of you? Okay, let's go down. Oh, they also have like crossbows. I surrender, but don't expect me to kiss your boots. You're an intruder here. Okay. Let's just knock you out and take your sheet. And where were the rest of you? I need to pick up all of your arrows. Ooh, wait. Hmm, looks like none of them really had guns. Don't tell me that's all they were like uh <coughs> use over here. Where did I kill the other guys? Hmm. Guess I will have to like look around. So, aren't you going to shoot? I won't tell you anything under torture. So you'd better kill me now, Drifter. Thank you. At least I am I'm nice to you guys. I'm not even killing you. Well, some of you I killed. Sorry about that, but nothing I could really do about that. So
the only thing I really need now is um, my backpack because I can't craft shit now <clears throat> let's just check I'm gonna switch with this guy since I can't um, like uh, I don't have my backpack to craft any of the stuff so yeah I think that's about it for them over here. I need to go that way, it seems. But um, let me just quickly check out this place here. Oh, there's another one of you. Oh, hey. How you doing, my bro? Get knocked the fuck out. Anything else? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Okay. So, I guess, I think we need to... Yeah, go this way. Like inside or... Oh, out this way, I think. Is it? Yeah. Somewhere down here. Can I jump in the water? Uh, I don't think so. Uh, I think I need to go up. Up where I was, because there was a thing where I could like slide down. was it okay I guess up the stairs we go I can't believe how quick those guys like gave up hopefully I can find um what's his name again oh man no, I can't remember his name oh shit well ow is that oh my god holy shit um can we go back please oh hell no um i hate this place can we please not God damn it. Alto Aliosa. Aliosha. I can't parade. I can't remember his name. Looks like Aliosha has survived the fall as well. At least the locals seem to be speaking of him. I should try and find him. Preferably without alerting the locals, they seem to be protective of their territory. Yep. Okay, I'm a little scared. That little fucking. Nope. I don't like the sound of that thing at all.
And I hate it even more because it's night time. Hello? Oh, fuck. Run! Oh, hell no. Ah! Get on the ladder now. <laughs> Holy shit. I don't like this at all. Motherfuckers. Nope. Me not likey at all. Um. Well, guys. Um. <laughs> yeah. This is scary as fuck. Holy shit. The way that thing like shakes everything. Holy shit. There's still no um, workbench it seems. I don't really like that. But I guess we will have to live with it. But, I think I'm gonna leave this uh, episode here. I know there wasn't really much action going on, but I am scared shitless at the moment. Because um, it's night time and I don't wanna really fucking um, go down. But um, yeah, with that said, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, a thumbs down. And also remember to subscribe if you don't subscribe yet and I'll see you guys in the next one.